You just walk in like a wrapped Christmas present. Hey, if you're stiff, just move your dress. Hey, oh sh well hello there beautiful people welcome back to my channel i hope you are doing well and right now i feel like i have to take a little bit of a deep breath before i tell you what had happened with um me spending some money on um azos um i had a little bit of a kind of closet clear out major like just getting rid of my old clothes and i had a, I had a big old clear out and obviously when you have a clear out you need to spend some more money to get some new goodies so I've ended up going on to one of my old school favorite sites, which is ASOS. And I have, I, I, girls, girls and boys, yeah, I spent, I spent some money, but right, it's been a while. Like I haven't done an I spent a video for quite a while. If I'm gonna spend my money, I'm happy to spend it on ASOS because I'm quite confident that, you know, I'm gonna get some goodies. We're gonna see what I have and we're gonna try it out. Also, what I wanted to let you know is that this is the start of Brightmas. We have Brightmas, which hopefully is going to make your day a little bit brighter in the lead up to Christmas. I really want to help you guys with your shopping decisions. I'm going to have a vlog every single week because I know people love vlogs as well. But we're going to be shopping. We're going to be bougie. We're going to be budget. We're going to be we're going to be doing all of it. So get ready. And also, I don't know when this video is going out. Hopefully, this is the day before Black Friday. Listen, get your pen and paper ready. Look in my description bar below. If I can find coupon codes and discounts, I will have them down below. You need to bookmark goodies. If there's anything you see that you like, bookmark it. Because by the time Black Friday comes, you don't wanna have to be like, oh, it's sold out. Oh, I can't find that item. No, save it to a little bookmark. Because I know a lot of people, they like to do their Christmas shopping, or if they're gonna have a closet clear out, they're gonna do it now. Because listen, if you can get 30% off or 40%, off why would you not do it doesn't make no sense so Femme, i feel like i need to just show you the levels the, le the levels hold on oh, i can't even lift the um this this is the levels um yeah it, it's it's really a lot when you spend some money on azos i spent in total i think i spent 1407 pounds something along those lines right Woo! <laughs> I'm out of breath thinking about it. But I got everything, trainers, bags, clothing. I got everything. But well, let's just talk about the website. So ASOS. ASOS is a website that lots of us know and love. I feel like I'm smiling because I'm actually genuinely like an old school ASOS fan, but I haven't shopped on ASOS for quite a while. You can get lots of different brands on ASOS. So you can get Whistles, you can get Misguided, you can get Boohoo, you can get um, Adidas, Nike, you can get almost every single brand. They do free, next day delivery, they do easy returns. That is why so many of us, I feel like, use ASOS as a website. I think sometimes their own stuff is hit or miss. So some is really good quality and some is, you know, this just looks, you know, crappy and cheap. Because what I wanted to do was kind of revamp, restock my wardrobe after it is now currently dust it's literally dust like blowing in the wind sand dry so i was like okay we need to just add some sass in there i'm gonna be honest i love azos because i've always been a girl who bought who bought stuff on there and it was one of the first online sites i ever used when i was like in university it used to be called as seen on stuff had like random 10 pound 20 pound 15 pound dresses on there it was backstreet but now it's like you know we all know it's like really kosher we love it so let's see what your girl has got okay I, I feel so excited for this video I, I don't know why anyway if you're not subscribed subscribe if you're not following my social follow me on my social as it is brightness we will be doing giveaways and goodies so make sure you are interactive on my instagram and on my twitter leaving comments liking i will be DMing you guys directly let's get into this video okay there's so many items. I'm gonna try and put like three or four items together at once to almost create, you know, it's a look, you know, we wanna look like a snack, like a total look. So I'm gonna do that because we will be here for seven hours trying on these clothing. If not, this video is gonna be a good 45 minutes long. So go get yourself a tea and a slice of cake right now before we get into it. Oh, I know what this is. This is just a little black dress. It's velvet. Velvet is very in for this season. Look at this, this little strappy sleeve. How do I actually get into this piece of rope? Right, let me see. OMG, 
this dress had all the dream it had all the vision but it covered none of the nipple it is one of those dresses that you just breathe on it and as i always say it's completely nipple to the wind look how cute it is i love the chain detail up here i like look at the asymmetrical leg and everything how nice does that look i don't know maybe it's something to do with the way the the chain is maybe the chain oh sh just broke oh my god he just snapped do you know what all it needs is that the chain just needs to be slightly um more attached but clearly the chain is currently broken so i'm gonna see what i have to do but actually like that it looks really nice because i'm getting coverage and i'm getting side thigh all good looks but it's not good looks if i just expose myself to the entire world i do like it but i need i need to get the chain fixed clearly but that shouldn't just pop up. Imagine you were at dinner and then all of a sudden your chain popped and your boobs fell out. That wouldn't be fun. Well, it would be fun for whoever's sitting opposite you, but yeah. <laughs> okay, these two are Adidas. Sometimes, I don't know what it is. I don't look so good in sportswear. I feel like it doesn't necessarily suit me. So let's see what I look like. Oh, I'm not sure about this neckline on me. I don't know. I look like just a floating head. Actually, is it all right? I don't know. I feel, furthermore, I feel like I'm a pregnant woman from the 80s. Something about this fit just looks, I don't know. I do like the leggings though. Like, yo, look at this. I like the leggings. I like the velvet. I'll show you guys. These are some really nice velvet leggings. Cute. And I got the size 8. I bought 8 and 10. But actually, I quite like the size 8. They fit really nicely. Can't see all the cellulite and jazz. I feel like this jumper just makes me like a potato. You know, I wanted to be Instagram cool and all that jazz, you know, my Adidas and that jazz. But like, at some moments I like it, some moments I don't. So this is £63, so I probably don't like it as much. So usually price is the deciding factor at £63. This can go back. Um, I will keep the leggings. They're £33. Can you see the way that it just shines? Shining. Okay guys, this is so damn heavy. I just picked out the bag. I know why I picked this up. This dress was 180 pounds, but party season is in the air. And I did kind of want a dress that really, really stood out. And it is heavy. I'm excited. I saw this, I was like, I had to have it. And do you know what? Because I know when I do these videos, you guys end up buying stuff. And then when I want to like chain size or something, it's all sold out. That's why I pick up two for myself, just in case. Oh my gosh. Oh. Dun, 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 na, 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 na. Does it clash with my hair though? This dress has got me looking like one Christmas tree. Can you hear it? You will hear me before I walk in. Yeah. Oh, it's got tassel. This is the nicest thing I've ever seen on Azor. But you can't wear a bra with it. How are you meant to wear this? Really see-through. Oh my, no. I'm very scared of damaging this dress. I need help. Makes my stomach look like it's on flat flat. Yes. Oh Lord, we lost the bead. We lost the bead. We lost two beads. I have an awards that I'm going to, but I think this dress might be a little bit too much. I just fought to get into this dress. I actually took off my bra, put on nipple covers. I'll show you my favorite nipple covers. Oh Lord. These are my favorite nipple covers. These are ASOS. These are really, really, really good. And they last for ages. Now, here's this dress on. I look like one glistening, you are gold, shining, shining soldier. I love the military look. It's a little short, I'm not gonna lie. It's a little short, but because it's covered up and stuff on top, I feel like I can get away with it. I think it is beautiful. However, we have lost like a handful of beads already and I've just tried the dress on. Look at this. You can't miss me in this dress. I feel like I can hear beads just falling to the ground and I feel like that's every pound just falling to the ground. It is gorgeous. I'm not gonna lie, it's gorgeous. This is one of those, it's my time to shine, New Year's Eve, I walked up in the building dresses. My stomach looks like it's on flat flat. The curves are looking good. And for me, it's the, oh, no, I swear down, I can just hear it going clink. Yes, Azos, you tried. You really did try. Ow, wow. Look at this, wow. Come on, come on. Dun, dun, dun. You know what, you have to create a new dance with this. Hey, come hey. Look at that, all of that movement. If you're stiff, just move your dress. Okay, so next up, I have joggers. I wanted skinny joggers. It's getting cold, so these are the black skinny joggers. And then this is a red um, sweater. I think, 
Oh, it's petite. Oh, it's £35 and these were £18. I don't know why I'm picking red items. I feel like I really want red in my wardrobe for some reason. This is very cute. OMG. So the trousers, I thought these were joggers. They're not joggers. They're just like loose trousers. But they're really nice. I like them on. I like the jumper. Do you know what's crazy? I do like me in red. But it's a little short, but not too short. Listen, we don't have literally gi giraffe arms coming out. This is actually a petite jumper, so I'm surprised that it fits me so well. I love the detailing, and it's a crop jumper, but without being literally crop, I see your underboob. Just because for me as well, when I wear crop, it has to be loose crop. It can't be just like, ooh. That just shows every lump and every bump. Like, no, it's not necessary. But this is nice. This has got a nice fit. And then here are the trousers. Look, they're kind of like military trousers. They're really loose, but I could wear like tights or leggings underneath to stay extra warm. They are they are doing nothing for the booty, like literally nothing, absolutely nothing. But these are more about comfort. I love this little detailing there as well. Okay, I found the super skinny joggers I was looking for. They're here. These are eighteen pounds, and then I don't know why I bought this red bow top. Like I'll be wrapped up like a Christmas present. It's from River Island, but sold on um, ASOS. I I'm excited to get this on. This one is a wow. This one is a wow. What? I feel like singing Santa baby. Na, 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 na. Oh my gosh. I haven't even got it on yet. I just got over carried away. Hold on. It's really cute. It's actually really cute. I would wear this. Sweating. Sweating while getting into this. But is this not cute? Santa baby. This is so cute. I feel like you'd wear this with a long skirt, like a little long white skirt. I don't know where I'm going. I don't know who I'm asking to unwrap me, but girl, this is just a keeper one that you need to have in your closet anyway. It's actually really nice quality. I love River Island. I need to do what I spent on River Island. It's so cute. I love this. And then these are the joggers. I mean, they're giving me major camel, major camel. I bought some Giselle trainers. Should we show, let me show you the trainers on. They'll probably look good with the trainers. I just bought some casual black Giselle trainers. I say casual, but the white is just glistening. Wow, it's very bright. They're very bright, aren't they? I feel like they need to be all black. They're very comfortable though. Actually, they're cute, they are cute. Let me put the other one on. Oh, my feet look small. I'm shocked, my feet look miniature, yes. Listen, for all my ladies with, you know, boat feet or large feet, the goal is always to never have your feet looking too big. Just so you guys know that I'm not mad, I want you to see the top paired with like a little um, black pencil skirt. This is actually from ASOS as well. But yeah, you can see how it would look like this, not with the jogging bottoms and trainers, but with some high heels. You just walk in like a wrapped Christmas present, ready. Listen, it's cuffing season out here, okay? Get ready. This is how you cuff. So I bought a couple of jumpers as well. This jumper is nice. It's off the shoulder, but I feel like you can wear it like that as well if you want to, but it does this. It's really nice. It's really, oh, something's poking me. It's just the tag, it's just the tag. I thought there was like a creature or something in it. Okay, um, yeah, really like this off the shoulder. Love all the like fluffy and ruffle detail on that. That is super, super cute. It's like knitted and warm, but you know, for the gram, you take it off the shoulder, you show your clavicle. We know that clavicle is the new cleavage. If you don't have boobies, everyone has clavicle. And then, you know, when it's really cold, you just be like, no, no, <laughs> cover that clavicle up nicely. I really like that. This is will look so nice with a pair of like dark indigo jeans and some boots. Yeah, I love that. That is that's a, such a me jumper because you guys know I love showing a shoulder. I feel like a baby sick grizzly bear, but I kind of like it. It fits so weird. I feel like I look like a bear. Like, I love. It's, it's not even oversized. It's just big. I feel like I've got a bodysuit on. Is it just me? Oh. This one I wish you lot were here. I said just explain it to me. I need I need help. Is this nice or is this not nice? I like the colour and it's listen, I need to, I need you to see how how soft this is. This is so so soft right now. Oh yes. It feels so good. But it, I just look boxy AF mate. Boxy, berry, and baby sick. The three B's. Like it's an it's a no. A lot of you guys ask me about where I get my like crew neck 
or my square neck tops. I get them from ASOS, this is them. And I also bought some joggers. I feel like I wanna wear a lot of joggers right now, so let's see what they're looking like. It's lovely, it's super casual. I knew it would be nice because I have this top in the black, but I didn't have it in the white. Can you see how like square neck that is? I love this and it isn't too low, so you don't have to see all the girls all the time. And do you know what, for a skinny jogger, these are not bad at all. My booty does not look depressed. And I can kind of snatch my waist in if I just, you know, I need to re really tie this tight. But be like, yeah, snap. The bottoms look really cute. Just a pair of casual joggers. I feel like I just needed some casual joggers that I wouldn't be embarrassed to wear outside of the house. That's why I got so many. But these, these are actually nice. Like, it, it doesn't look awful. It doesn't look amazing, but it doesn't look awful, awful. This is just super casual. I love this top. I wear it so, so much in the black. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to get the white one as well. Okay, so I got carried away with some coats. This is £75. Is it shiny? Is it not shiny? Let's get it on. So I love... Oh, oh. Oh, my gosh. This is so warm. This is lit. Look at this. It's £75. But I don't mind paying for a good winter jacket that's going to keep me warm because my kidneys listen they need warmth this is so cute look at the detailing on that it's got like little faux fur on there all over the inside and just down the bottom as well i have to show you guys it looks so nice on i actually think 75 pounds is a bargain Let's see what it looks like when i'm zipped up because you know i'm not going to be doing pretend it's warm out here with my jacket unzipped no. yes this is lovely! Oh, I'm upset because I think I like everything. So, um, we're gonna have to work out how we're gonna, what, what we're taking back because you can't like everything because that's a, that's money. That is money. Oh, this is so nice. This is really, really, really nice. Like, if you are wanting to find a jacket for the cold, this is an option. It's really warm on the inside. I'm impressed. And I bought this jacket as well. I was like, I'm trying to not have so much black in my wardrobe. Oh, see, this is one of these, yeah, that it's, it gives you false hope. It makes you look at it thinking that, oh, it's really warm, it's really cosy. I think this is £65. Makes you think it's really warm and cosy, but this is as light as a feather. You can't tell me anything in my multiple fur textured coat. You cannot tell me anything. I love it. I love it. Actually, it can just be like off shoulder Instagram. One day, well, you know, we're gonna do a video on this, you know. The Instagram trends, off shoulder, it is cold. Why are your shoulders out? Wear your jacket properly. But still, I'm, I'll still do it. Look at this. Beautiful, it is beautiful. Oh, there's no pockets. It's still cute though. So this is a jacket that's more for decoration. That's what my dad say. This jacket is for decoration. If it's really cold, this is not gonna, it's not gonna protect you. Okay, so I bought this top. Can't even tell which way you get in. Cause I wanted one of those chainmail tops without having one of those chainmail tops because the way my breasts are set up, like it's gonna be all exposure to the wind. Like no. I don't know what it is. I feel like there's something in the air that's making me be a little bit more, not watchy, but a little bit more like, oh, okay. Hello, look at this. It's cute, you know, it's a great alternative to those chain mount top tops which are just too risky for me whereas this one isn't risky we've got some support around the neck we've got a little bit of back as look how much of my back is out but we don't have side too much side boob coming out we're safe we're secure i just paired these actually with, with a pair of jeans out of my closet i like trying on stuff now with stuff that i already have in my closet to see if i can make it work and this is cute. Now, this is more like, I, I would wear this for like New Year's or going out for drinks with the girlfriends if I wanted to dress up, but I don't want to wear a dress. What? But I like it. Do you like it? What do you guys think? You wouldn't take me home to your like mum or wearing this, would you? My mum would be like, put it away. I completely forgot that I bought a bag and it looks like amazing. It looks really nice. It looks a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. This is from Skinny Dip London. Look at that. That is really cute. And it's a massive inside. How nice is that? It's gorgeous. And it's silver hardware. I've been looking for some silver hardware stuff. Does that chain go long? You know what? You can put an iPad in here, your phone in here. Very, very nice. I really, really like that. Go skinny dip. Oh, this is nice. I like the colour. This is like a basic wrap top. I hope it's not giving me lactating mother. 
I don't know, there's something that gives me lactating mother about this. Let's see what it looks like on. This is nice. It's giving me marginal lactating mother in that it's just got this thing and I've been a lactating mother and it's like you could just literally get a boob out and feed the world and it just, it gives that vibe that you could, should just kind of separate it out. Maybe that's just in my head, but the color's really nice. It's a little too low for my liking, but I could just stitch it up. Like it needs to be up here. I don't know why they make everything so low. The colour's so, so nice and the fit is really nice. And this is one of those casual tops that I just um, reach for every single day with a pair of jeans. Like this is what I would be dressed like 99% of the time. So actually, it's a keep up because I can just put a little stitch in there. And the colour, the colour is my colour. I live for that. I think it looks really nice. Oh, okay, a couple more jackets. Okay, so I bought a bomber. I'm sure I had a blo I have a long green bomber. I had it last year. This is a short black bomber. I believe this is 40 pounds. Oh, this is gorgeous. This is a very gorgeous little bomber. I love an oversized bomber like this. The shape of this is really nice. Yeah, I've got to make a decision. I can't have every coat. I love this. I do like this. I'm laughing at this basically orange duvet. Oh, it's velvet though and it's nice. It's like a beacon like walking down the street in my like orange quilt. This is a duvet. But you know what, when it's cold, you will not care. If they had this in black, I would buy it. I don't know, it's a weird orange shade. But the principle of this jacket is nice. I love it. But no, it's an, it's a no. I bought another faux fur jacket. <laughs> I have a problem, okay, I have a problem. Leave me alone. Don't judge me. No, I just got a jacket just like this. But I really like it. I really like Plus it. Plus this one, the arms aren't so short. This is so nice. Life is cushy. Life is cozy. I'm warm. People know I have an obsession with coats. I always have, especially in the winter. I have a whole cupboard dedicated to coats. So it's always been a thing. I'm warm. That's all that matters out here. The arms are... Not too short, I've had worse. Oh, it was 65 pounds. Yeah, we can't have all these coats. We're gonna make a decision, we'll make a decision. Last few bits. This is a what were you thinking, Patricia? Why is it green? These look like one kind of the school uniform track pants that you were embarrassed to have to wear on sports day. Made it look so stylish on the girl. She was doing the lean back cock, she looked great. This is ridiculous. Let me see what it looks like on. These are not as awful as I thought they'd be on. I've got a little bit of the baggy fanny going on, just a little bit, but it isn't anything I can't handle, you know? It's not, it's not too, there's not too much gathering. These need to go home. These look quite cute. They're not what I thought what they would be. They are made of one kind of polyester kind of trouser material with all these stuck on beads at the front, which looks nice from far. Looks a bit cheap up close. Let me try them on anyway. What is this? This is like a section for you to enter. Like, what the hell? Why is there like a penis bit right there? There is no way to draw more attention to your nether regions than creating a landing strip to go right there. Why would you do that? The vision was right, but the delivery was so wrong. Landing strip to the vagina. Wow, this is ridiculous. I'm not going up. This is, <laughs> my bum's a pip. Like it's, the, they're all wrong, they're all wrong. This t-shirt isn't fabulous either. <laughs> Look at it together. Look at it together. Last two bits. I, I'm trouser crazy right now. Peg and peg leg trouser right, crazy right now. And then this little beaded top. Let's see what it looks like on. Oh, this looks cute. Ooh, I like this. Oh, let's see. Got a little bit more shoulder. You know, this season, let's just call it the shoulder season. We've got some beading, some pearls. We got some pearls on the um, shoulder area. It looks really nice. I am really loving, 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 loving this top. I think it looks really, really nice on. Got a bit of arm fat. I'm, I, you know, I've got this fat pocket right here. I just need to try and tuck it back. It kind of um, extenuates that fat pocket, but you know what? It doesn't even matter. I don't even care that much. But this is really nice. How nice is this? The neckline, everything is all me. That's all me. Okay, last bit. These are the last items. I don't know what it is with these kind of trousers. Everybody else looks so good in them. And I literally look like a mess. I look a train wreck. I look like a potato sack. I just look broad. Look how broad I look. I look like a broad bean. This is so ridiculous. I actually, I actually, I think I might have spoken to you. Soon. These are a size 10. Maybe I need a smaller size. I feel like you guys might know what I'm trying to get at, like with these kind of trousers and stuff. But I don't know, there's something about them that just make me look so bricky. I'm, I'm not sure. I feel like we slightly 
failed at the final hurdle but i'm going to give you guys my final thoughts now oh my gosh i'm utterly utterly out of breath right now oh my gosh but we're done we spent some money on the beloved azos and you know I, I love it i basically love all of it so we're gonna have to really do some thinking to work out what's going back and what is really really needed in my wardrobe i feel like asos is one of those places that you can't go wrong and the things that are more expensive are basically the designer or the brand stuff so i'm talking like adidas or nike or whistles that's the stuff that's more more expensive and of course they had that dress that had all the beading on it and that was 180 pounds but that looked to me like it was worth 180 pounds because it was heavy af and it was gorgeous and i'm like going to be wearing that for sure um overall i basically feel like i love everything and i'm so i haven't been on azos for probably about three to four months probably because i've been trying all these other shops you know from across the world and having some shopping experiences but it's nice to come back to like, you know, an old favorite that does you well, you know, like like the old boo. Coming back to ASOS, it feels so, so good. I love it. Like, but now I feel like I've got lots in my wardrobe. But for those of you guys who are getting ready for, um, you know, Black Friday or Christmas shopping or New Year shopping, I have links in the description bar below. Bookmark, don't purchase anything right now but make sure you purchase it at 12 o'clock because I know that I went onto the ASOS website today and it said 30% off um, for Black Friday. So just bookmark and be ready because you never know what's gonna happen. You know, you don't want it all sell out. So um, happy shopping. Hopefully you find some good stuff. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram and on my Twitter. So, um, in the meantime, I will catch you later. And yeah, all love and blessings this brightness season. Bye.